hi guys welcome to the channel today we are going to have a look how we can remove the deployed softwares and using the group policies the softwares which are up, which are deployed using the group policies now like I showed you in the last video I'll give the description for that video in So for this what we need is like shown in the last video we will go to our DC controller what we need to do is say, okay now we go to tools we'll go to do group policy management So this is the software which we deployed on the last video. Okay, so this was the software which was deployed in the last video. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to remove that and as shown in the last video, if we go to our client, this was installed so now what we will do we will remove the installation from the group policies on the server after removing them we will do an update and then you guys will see Adobe Reader will not be installed on the client anymore okay so what we need to go is go right click all task we need to go move okay so these two options immediately uninstall the software from users and computers or allow users to continue to use or but prevent new installations what we are going to do we are going to choose immediately uninstall the software from users and computer and press ok okay now what we will do is we will go back to our client mm -hmm. and we will open our control panel sorry command prompt and we will go gp update slash force now we are updating it Yes. Okay. And the next thing I'll show you in this video is how to redeploy the same software using group policies. The one which we have deleted, we will redeploy that. It's just restarting now. Okay, now if we go on to our desktop, if you see there is no Adobe Reader. Now what I'll show you guys is how to redeploy the same GPU. 
same application within the same GPU. So what I'm going to do is go right click new package go read up press ok assign just wait for that's the same process of as we same process as we did the first time when we made the new GPU point and put the new software installation in it it does take 10 to 15 seconds to show up here so it won't be long <laughs> So it shows up. So now what we need to do is go right click all tasks and redeploy the application. So redeploying this option will reinstall the application everywhere it is already installed. Do you want to continue? Yes. Okay. What we are going to do, we'll go back to our client, which is Windows 8. Now we'll go search. CMD. We will put the same command through. Special. Sorry. Update. Slash force. Now this will update it again. Press yes, close. As mentioned, I have shown in my previous video how to set up group policy to deploy the softwares or application to all the computers and servers on the domain uh, you can I'll mention the link for that video in the description so you guys can refer to it this is just the second part for that video how we are going to sh show uh, install application next um, onto the computers on the same domain in the next video, I'll show you guys how to publish, not assign, publish the softwares onto the domain using group policies. You can, if you like the videos, you can like, subscribe, and leave comments for any topics you want me to make tutorials on. So I'll just log into this, and I'll show you should be installed again so you can see after redeploying the software is back onto the our client okay please like and subscribe for to watch my old video about how to install GPU um, group how to set up group policies to deploy assign softwares onto the domain uh, you can watch that video thanks see you next time bye